Hi, welcome to the UW farm. My name is Griffin. I am the assistant manager here and an AmeriCorps volunteer. We're at the Mercer Corps site of our farm. And today I'm going to talk about occultation and solarization. The UW farm is a WSDA certified organic farm. So we do not use any synthetic herbicides. Part of our regenerative agricultural practices is using cover crop. So the steps are as follows. First, we need to cut the cover crop near soil level. Then we drag black plastic tarp over the top. It creates a warm environment for the cover crop to decompose. It creates a green manure to add the biomass back into the soil. We also use black plastic in this way to kill weeds. It creates a warm, humid environment for weed seeds to germinate and then prevents them from doing photosynthesis. Step three, we put weights on the edges of the plastic to hold it down so it doesn't blow away. Step four, we need to wait four to eight weeks depending on the, the weather, the temperature, before we can pull it back and start to plant in these beds. This is a process called occultation. Tarp that we can use for at least a decade. You can also use cardboard uh, in your garden or a smaller area. Another way we can prepare beds or kill weeds is using solarization. We drag a clear plastic tarp over the soil and it creates a greenhouse effect in the summer in full sun, warming up the soil to about 140 degrees at the height of the day. 